Some residents in this uptown Butte neighborhood have spent the past three years fighting what they say is increased blight and crime. And though there has been some improvements, they're afraid things are starting to get worse. It's a fight every day. If you just let it go, it starts to get worse again. And so then you're unsafe to walk around because some of these people are so high, they're dangerous. Residents have complained that squatters have taken shelter in these homes in the 700 block of Main Street, which have been labeled dangerous structures by the city. Healy believes someone is living in this detached garage to one of the homes. It's not supposed to be anybody in here. And we have done our due diligence. We have called the police. While I was doing my interview, the man who says he's leasing this garage in question came out and he and Healy had some harsh words, both accusing each other of creating a problem in this neighborhood. We're the side cleaning it up and doing the actual physical work and all she does is complains about us. I asked him if he's aware of the crime in the area. This is the hood of, of Butte. I mean, come on, what do you expect? I mean, that's what goes on around here. You know, but it's, it's, it's. But are you a part of that? No, thing? I'm not. I'm part of cleanup crew. People are accusing you of, of, of squatting and living yeah. in these places when they're. Oh, is that. What are you doing? That's not true. I, I work, you know, long hours. Okay. I work you know, when I want to work. Yeah. Okay. So, and some people think, oh, okay, you're staying there. No, I'm not. You're saying, oh, they think they're selling drugs and things like no, that. Is no, that no, there's no drug. Here? No. You're not, not selling drugs. No, I don't sell drugs. Okay. Some residents say they're fed up with the junk homes. All of this needs to be cleaned up, and I don't think it's too much to ask as a neighborhood to have everything cleaned up. Police and city officials arrived at the scene that day and informed Richardson that he could clean the garage during the day, but could not stay there overnight. In Butte, John Amy, MTN News.